Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your iPhone and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you set up do not disturb on your iPhone? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to set up do not disturb on your iPhone anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe you run a business and you're in and out of meetings all day long and you don't want your employees, your contractors, or your customers blowing up your phone while you're in meetings. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here mostly in the settings app on your iPhone. It's this gray gear icon looking thing. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to go ahead and open up my settings app now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened my settings app. This is the drop down menu you're going to see. And in order to set up, do not disturb on your iPhone, you're going to have to scroll down until you get to this section here called focus. It has like a little purple moon next to it. Once you click there, you're going to see another drop down menu, but today we are setting up the do not disturb on your iPhone. So click on this button here, do not disturb. Okay guys, so here is where you can go ahead and set up the settings for your do not disturb. So basically when you turn this function on, then you're not gonna receive notifications or calls coming in. And that way you won't be disturbed while you're in your business meeting. However, sometimes there are specific apps or specific people that you do want to be able to contact you while this is turned on. So in order to do that, you can go ahead and add people here. So you can see I have none added. You can also add apps into the different apps that are okay to contact you while you have do not disturb. Also, if you know you have specific meetings at specific dates or times, you can go ahead and set up a schedule for your do not disturb to turn on by clicking on this blue add schedule button, but those are completely optional. Now, once you've set up the settings for your do not disturb, it's pretty easy to turn on your do not disturb on your iPhone. All you're gonna do is just swipe down from the top right on your screen. Once you do that, you're going to see all of the different options, but you wanna go ahead and click on focus. Once again, it has the moon icon next to it. All right, once you do that, you wanna go ahead and click on do not disturb. You can see it's currently in black and white, but when you click on it, it will turn purple right here and white. So now I will not receive notifications except for the contacts that I have approved or the applications that I have approved. And let me close this down. Okay, now you can see that I have the moon icon in purple right here. Also on the top part of my iPhone, I see a moon shape right here. So that means that my phone is in do not disturb mode. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to turn on do not disturb mode for your iPhone, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click the thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.